guys, it's Monday and it's four o'clock and it's sunny outside. <sighs> Not functioning very well because we just lost an hour of sleep. Damn you daylight savings. Hey guys, it's Cal and this is five days of something. I don't know if you can hear it in the background, but my brother is playing Street Fighter in the background. Hopefully you can't hear it, so I hopefully I can drown it out with music. So today, I actually wanted to talk to you guys about how to get a boyfriend or how to get the guy that you like to ask you on a date. It's very simple. I came up with 10 steps that can assure you that you will get your date. Step number one, stalk him. When he sees that you're stalking him and watching his every move, it's going to interest him and think, hmm, I wonder why this girl's following me. Then it will lead him to asking you questions and blah, blah, blah. And maybe you guys will be happy together. Here we go. Learn everything about him. Learn about his hair color, his eye color, when he was born, what hospital, what's his mom name, his dad name, his sister, his brother, if he has them, his pet, how long he's lived here, how long has he been in his sports, how long has he loved basketball, football, all that stuff. If he has a secret obsession with like Hello Kitty or he likes girly scents or He's a video gamer, find out what his video game is, learn everything about him. Next step you want to do is find out where he lives. You actually can watch him to see if there's any other girls working around his house. You know, just keep an eye on him. I know you trust him, but at the same time, you know, those girls aren't there. Not to be trusted. You can always just watch from the bushes of his house, like I do. If you have a class with him or you're working with him, make him notice that you're staring at him. So he can be like, oh, she wants all of this. You know what I mean? Of course I want all of that. But you come and get this. This one, he should be asking you out already by the time. But if not, call him, but don't say a word. Just breathe heavily. Just breathe and breathe so he can think, who is this mysterious person on the phone? And boom, I think it's you. This is my favorite. Make albums of the both of you. Um, when you guys first met, when he first asked you out, your first day, your marriage, uh, your wedding, the babies you're gonna have. Speaking of babies, make a baby album of you two so he can see how well you guys will make beautiful babies together. Talk to his family. So later on, when he's sitting in his room, his mom can just walk in and be like, sweetheart, I like that girl, that Emily girl. She's very sweet. You should definitely date her. Listen to your mother's boys. They know what's best. To announce your love to the world, make a like page on Facebook of your relationship. So everybody, especially those trifling girls, can know about your relationship and how happy you guys are. Now, this is the one that I love doing. Create a love video of you two. Get of him sleeping when you sn snuck into his room last night, uh, when he was riding his bike to school the other day, when he was walking his dog, when he was texting, when he was in the car. Get all those videos and combine them together just to show him how much you want him and how much you love him and care for him. And lastly, if all else fails, Kidnap him, torture him, and make him ask you on a date. Okay guys, hope those actually, those tips work for you. Um, they've never worked for me, so hopefully they work for you. Uh, last time I tried those steps, I actually got arrested and have a restraining order. But it's okay, I know he still loves me and he wants to be with me. Bye guys. Alright guys, go ahead and check out the videos below. Below, below here, below here, and below here. Or wherever they are. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with Danielle. We're shooting tomorrow, so. See you guys tomorrow.